In this video, I'm going to take you over how to delete your Facebook posts and batch delete. You've been adding photos to Facebook for a long time and you might want to get rid of them because you've got a whole bunch here in your photo gallery and whatnot and posts and things over the years and you just want some more privacy to get rid of all of them. Well, there's a plugin out there that actually batch deletes the uh, the, the posts on a month-to-month -month basis over the years. It's a little bit um, uh, macro in regards to having to um, go through each month, but you know, you'll get there and it's really about that and it's called Social Post Social Book Post Manager and it's an extension for the Google Chrome browser. So you gotta be using the Google Chrome browser, not Firefox, and then you can install extensions. Those are like plugins that add on to expand the functionality of your Chrome browser. These extensions can be found in your extension manager, window drop down at the top of your browser, extensions, and you can go in and look at all the extensions that you've loaded in your area. As you'll see, I've installed social post, social book post manager and turned it on. It has to be on, okay? The details, you can go to the details of the plugin um, or read over the uh, how to use it and stuff in the overview. You'll have to expand a bit um, down at the bottom here. And if you go down, it tells you the instructions here. And basically the instructions are log into Facebook, go to your activity log. So if you wanna find out where your activity log, it's right here on your, your main page. See right here at the top, that's where everything's going on that you're constantly doing. And that can show you all the things that you're liking. And I just came from looking at hearings about Zuckerberg and stuff. You know, what he asked and what he didn't um, during his trial with, uh, with Europe and stuff and where he was on and being asked about privacy for people. So if you want to go back and you can go back to like, you know, post back from the beginning since you started uh, Facebook and you can go back to like, let's go to 2008, see what's going on. So let's, let's see that um, I, I just deleted some from 2009. And um, I want to get I want to get rid of a bunch of photos that I post. Or let let's go 2010. Okay, let's let's see if I wanted to get rid of this. Uh, some of the Mayan calendars coming. <laughs> so if you want to get rid of these, you make sure that the plugin is on. Okay, so it says click the extensions button to open the interface. If needed, choose year, month, text contains, text not contains. I'll take you. Over. Click the delete post button. The extension will scan through your activity log and mark all the posts matching the conditions. The pre-scan process may take a long time. Remember, it does. It takes a little bit and goes, this is a, you've got an hour here, an hour there activity once a week. Put it in your Google Calendar to just keep doing it here and there to clean up things. You don't do it, like, go as far as you can, but it's an ongoing activity to clean it up until you're happy. After the pre-scan finishes, this will confirm button and show it at the top, and it'll verify things. When, they, when it's done, the extension reports the total number of posts deleted. So let's try it once. So let's go to Facebook. I went to the activity log. Say I wanted to wipe out the stuff in December of 2011. So up here in your toolbar, you'll see that same icon right here, okay? See, social post book manager. Choose the, the year, the month. Say if it contains something in the text or, or does not contain, pre-scan the page. Um, check if you need to preview. I don't need to preview anything. I'm just gonna go delete. So, so if we wanted to go 2011, December posts, we just go here and let's go December, change that to 2011. And now we click the delete button here. Well, let's see what happens. Confirm the delete, post satisfying all conditions will be deleted. Deleted posts are not recoverable. That's what we want. Okay, now it's going. So boom, you can see in the background, something's going on. And it's, it's wiping them out. It's going delete, 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 delete. It's just cleaning them up. All these strange posts that I don't even remember. I take no responsibility in what I posted back then. Sometimes it might need a confirmation, I've noticed. Um, but it is what it is. So it's, it's wiping out things that I don't know about. I don't want this out anymore. You know, I just, I don't know. I just, I just want to control my content. And I think that's really what we're talking about here is controlling what's, what's out there. Um, and you know, if you want to clean things up, you know, it's, it's, it's an okay thing. And this is a simple way of doing it with a plugin from the Chrome web store, which you can go to. There's lots of really neat plugins, by the way, but this social post book, po po social book post manager is easy to install to Chrome 
and see this says delete just delete and just keep going sometimes they'll need some confirmations on some I'm just gonna keep going delete and permanently delete just to help it's already been deleted and I don't know I guess I guess it needs a little bit I'm just I'm giving it assistance here by clicking on these I don't know if I left it if it would keep going um, not sure I'm gonna keep deleting deleting unsure what this is all about Let's see if it just keeps going, if it's going to keep on wiping things out. Seem, yeah, it's still going. For some reason, it paused some earlier. So I think it's pretty good that it's batch deleting and deleting and deleting. I like it. Um, I'm, I'm okay with the uh, momentum of it and what it's doing. So it seems to be continuing to delete items. Um, and it, we'll see what happens at the end of this. And I'll show you that it pops up and it actually gives you a confirmation at the very end of how many posts that you've deleted. I guess I was pretty busy back then. <laughs> 2011, I think I was working for Bruce County Tourism and I was getting into the content stuff. I started in 2009, this was when the big boom of Facebook back then and social media when even before the times when people uh, didn't, didn't see uh, social media icons in every single store that they went in to join. Uh, I was at the infancy of it as a social media manager, learning what that meant, take marketing to social media marketing. But I got into creating a lot of content, and I guess I just content happy for my own stuff too, just constantly taking photos. But this is an easy way to clean up your Facebook. And otherwise, Facebook doesn't allow you to batch delete a whole year, a whole month. You have to go one by one by one. So this plugin is fantastic. So um, I'll just forward to the end of this, um, this video clip here to show you the end uh, so that you don't have to watch this whole part. And here it is. This is the uh, mission accomplished. And it says deleted 215 posts from that month. Um, none of the belows require the extension does not need to be checked. So that's fantastic. So that's it in a nutshell. I've accomplished my goal here to uh, to delete that many posts. So if you want to use the tool, I totally suggest I'll put some links in the uh, description below to easily um, link to the Chrome Web Store for the social book post manager. Hey, I said it this time. And um, if you have any questions, just let me know. It's a little buggy, but um, it is still working and it's like July 18th, 2020. If you have any questions, just ask them again below and please remember to subscribe. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video and I'll see you in another one.